And Benue State is on a global humanitarian map due to the biometric data capturing of internally displaced persons, IDPs, with over 77,000 IDPs. International humanitarian partners are committed to providing sustainable interventions. The Executive Secretary of the United States of America has announced plans to visit the state next year to intervene in the situation of IDPs in Benue urging journalists to extend their visits to other IDP camps. Uh, now, uh, the international community are aware of the Benue situation. Through this biometric access, we have been sending the figures. Uh, I'm happy particularly to know that the United States of America are not interested in the Benue IDP situation. They are coming to visit Benue State in January. And they are, they are even planning to take our, our challenges. So we are waiting for them in general. That was a report we received because of the result of this biometric research. So we are happy that uh, this uh, IOM are willing to help us to make sure that Benue has been launched to the global community. Father Hyacinth earlier has shown strong commitment to returning internally displaced persons to their communities and appreciating the federal government's intervention in the Benue situation. The federal government is almost taken over the Benue resettlement agenda as a result of the passion the governor has for this IDP situation and the humanitarian crisis generally. The federal government is also coming in now seriously to, to assist us. Also receive allocation notes from NEMA, allocating about six trucks of food and non food items to Bonner State. Try to assist what we are doing. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.